What is up guys, Rhythm Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today guys, I got something amazing for you. Abandoned Adam's Family House. Not the actual Adam's Family, but you've already seen the intro, so let's check it out. All right guys, so we're starting at the back mud room. And as you can see, the mud, the, the laundry tub has been pulled away from the wall. We've got bits of stuff all over the ground. Looks like it's pine cone bits. Yeah, there's the pine cone right there. And over here, you got the electrical panel, some hooks. Now this is the basement, completely unfinished. No need to go down there guys. because Oh, the stairs are actually super sketchy and I can see it rotten at the bottom. So I'm not even gonna risk that nonsense. But here we go, big country kitchen, lots of space as often is with a lot of these farmhouses. They've got huge, huge kitchens because a lot of entertaining was done, not only dining, but entertaining. We've got a bathroom here, kind of modernized looking. Oh, gonna blur that out, but you got a Hustler magazine there. What year is that from? Uh, I don't see a year easily visible, but Ed Norton's on there, Kate Sonny's Wildlife. But yeah, I have to blur that out if anything was there because I don't want any pornography on my uh, channel. But there's a nice sun porch out here. We'll check that out after, guys. Nothing really to it, it's just the sun porch, but we've got modern uh, oven over there, convection oven. All this cupboard space, pretty decent. And of course, over here, there you got the concrete slab, which actually doesn't, is it, might be fiber rock uh, for the old stove that once would have been in here, the wood stove that actually heated the place. And right now it is May and it's friggin' cold. It's been snowing. Got a storage. I actually thought that might've been another basement access. So we got a room right here. I don't know if this is a bedroom or living room, but as you can see, it looks like it was kind of modernized doors. Oh, and look at this. Someone did some mudding and taping over here as if they were going to renovate it, but clearly, as you can see from the ceiling, guys, it's not getting uh, renovated anymore. Nice medallion up there. You know, it's back here. Oh, well, back here we got a bathroom. Oh, and that must have been, so this room was actually bigger, so they added this on at one point in time to make another bathroom. So that's two bathrooms on the floor, on the ground floor. Now speaking of floor, nice plank wood here. It could definitely use a good sand and a refinish. Now here's a little peek at the staircase, which you saw in the intro as well, but beautiful staircase. We'll go check that out in a minute, guys. Got another nice big sitting room. I like that little nook over there where you can sit, read a book, have a coffee, drink a beer, whatever you feel like doing. But as you can see, lots of nice hardwood uh, baseboards and trim around all the um, walls and windows. And of course, you got another medallion up top there. But these rooms are just gigantic in height. Then, so this would have been where that bathroom is. And they've sealed it off. It's kind of weird to do that. But I guess if you want another bathroom, and I guess this must have been the main front door. Weird. It's strange, because I usually the front door is like front, but that one's on the, uh, those two are on the side. So here we go, the staircase. And this would have been the door. That's where that sun porch led to, this door. However, as you can see, it's been completely sealed off. I don't know if that was security measures or what, but let's just have a little look up here. Let's try it again. But let's just have a little look up the stairs, because, I mean, you've got a little bit of a curve right around there, all the way over to this spot. And as you can see, you got some hmm, mold and kind of decay growing on it. And look at this, plaster coming right off the walls. But also, check out the detail here, guys. 
Nice detail. All the way around. And look at, you got a three step or a four step right there and a two step right there with a bedroom. So I'm not really sure why that would be, but it's pretty interesting. So you got a room over here. Ceiling is definitely failing. You got a bit of black mold, but guys, the air is totally fine in here. And look at that funky ceiling fan. Never seen one like that before. And over here, it looks like there might have been some decay happening that's been since repaired, but not very well. Holy. Now this is a pink room. A very pink room. A little too uh, pink for my liking. It's just wow. And you can see down here, there was wood and they put carpet over it because the carpet uh, glue is still there, but they scraped all most of it off. It needs a good sanding and then refinish. So this might have been an apartment because you do have this lock right here, but everything is accessible only from one staircase that I found so far. And have another look at that staircase. Because you know, if you've been following me, you know what I, how I feel about staircases. Well, look, we got like the whole farm right here. You got zebra, cat, or I don't know if that's a lion or elephant, and all sorts of bar or zoo creatures. This is actually a pretty decent sized room if it's a kid's room, which I'm assuming so because I can't see many adults having those little stencils of uh, animals on their wall. You got a bathroom. Oh, wow. Kind of a skinny but long bathroom and you do have a shower over there oh yeah and we got a mirror right here because what is up guys oh busted mirror someone's come in and smashed that unfortunately some closet space and this is directly below, or above, sorry, that uh, front living room that had the exact same shape. So the exterior is gonna look similar on the uh, two levels. But again, great big rooms. And as you can see, if we go out here, this leads to the staircase, which we'll have a little look down right now. Cause you just can't get enough of the staircases. And actually there's a nice, chilling spot right here you can look out the window see what's going on look at the east trot they're completely full of roof shingle bits now this is really cool i'm gonna have to take my backpack off because it's a tight squeeze but you guys will love this so cut this little room and this room is part of the actual tower that you saw on the uh, front of the house, which is like, which is pretty, pretty much why I call it the Adams Family House because it's shaped similar to what the Adams Family's house look like, with the big tower, and it's a very rare feature these days, and especially with uh, abandoned places, you don't see it that much. And there's a look down those stairs, very very tight. I don't really know what this would be used for. Maybe sitting up here, waiting for your husband to come home when he's out there farming the fields or come up here to get away from the kids. It's hard to say. Oh, look at this. Look at that egg. That's a big egg. You know, for comparison size, I need to put my hand beside it. Like, that's a big egg. That could be uh, maybe a turkey vulture because there is a hole up there in the netting. And there's lots of bird feathers and poop, so there's a good chance that that's a turkey vulture or another large bird. Because most birds' eggs are quite small. That one almost looks like a chicken egg size. But yeah, these stairs are not easy to navigate. But that's so cool. I've never seen a house with one of these before. Well, I have, but I've never actually explored one. So this is definitely a treat. All right, guys, well, that's the end of this epic adventure. Abandoned Adam's family house, 
really, really unique design. We got that wicked tower up front. We got that beauty staircase and just lots of different colors and really, really cool architecture throughout. But anyways, guys, tell me what you think in the comments down below. If you're not subscribed, definitely subscribe. Smash the like button. And remember, guys, always come back because Ritter Rider always has that epic shit. All right, thanks for watching. Peace. What is up guys, Ritter Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today guys, I got something so cool for you. Abandon Adam's family country. Okay. What is up guys, Ritter Rider back again with another epic adventure. Today guys, I got something amazing for you. A ba uh, 